Good day, Tampa Bay. I'm Charlie Belcher coming to you from Lakeland this morning. Our cool school of the week is the Harrison School for Performing Arts. And oh, what a beautiful, wonderful place. I want to build a time machine, go back in time, and enroll here. Uh, Daryl Ward is our principal here. We're inside an art gallery. A lot of school, a lot of high schools don't have art galleries, but boy, this one looks like I'm walking into a museum. Right. It's a dedicated art space for our students to show their work. What's on the walls now, this is we're all about global connections as well. This is a part of the Sister Cities International competition, and that exhibit actually opens tonight with a reception. So our students, it's not just our students on the wall, their work here, it's all over Polk County. Um, so again, it's a connectivity kind of thing, but, but this is a dedicated space. Our teachers will come in here and teach in here sometimes for critiques and so forth. So yeah, as you said at the break, you and I were talking, we do try and really maximize yeah. our space. Uh, and Dr. Phillips is uh, here, who is the, uh, uh, te teaching the, uh, the guitar class, tell me with the, right. the guitar music we're hearing. Well, we have the guitar department here, and this is my uh, elite ensemble they audition to get in. You're here hearing a piece now by Grammy Award winning composer Andrew York, who's doing a residency with us next week, which will culminate in a concert on March 6th, uh, Thursday night, 7.30 p.m. So I hope to see some of you there. Let's, let's show the guitar players. Let's, let's, let's see them in action over there. It's all about the kids today. Uh, and it, how, many, uh, how many students in the program? Uh, the entire program has about 30 kids in it right now. And uh, this is, as I said, this is the eight that had to audition to be in this particular ensemble. It's, it's wonderful. They sound incredible. And, and Mr. Ward, this is, I mean, you guys offer music and theater and film curriculum and art and, I mean, and creative writing starting soon. Right. And we have dance, you know, ballet and modern dance. We have a piano department. We have a, a four-year jazz program where the students actually get improv classes and jazz as well. So it's really all, of, it's all curricularly driven. You know, it's not just showing up and drawing all day or playing music all day. There is a curriculum. The teachers follow that curriculum. Again, that's what creates these students in, in developing the art process. And physically connected to Lakeland Senior High School. I mean, it, it's it's a, it's a an interesting program. 500 students, I'm sure you'd like to have 2,500 students if, well, you, if the space would allow. Well, we're looking on hoping to improve that in enrollment as well because we can take some more students. And again, it's all about getting as many students as possible access to an arts education. Keep up the good work with Thank your you, cool Charlie. school. I will leave you with a little more guitar music, ladies and gentlemen. Stick around, everybody. It's Friday. Make sure you make it a good day, Tampa Bay. Thank you.